Hello everyone and welcome back to my heavenly babies. I'm Angel and I'm back today to share the second baby I have for sale um, out of my collection. This one is the Real Born Lewis Asleep will come with a certificate. The baby is 18 inches and almost five pounds. And um, I got it off of Reborns.com and um, it was like December, late December or January. It was around Christmas time when I got this one and I got it and had her as a girl. Angelica was her name. Um, but this baby obviously was based off a boy. So I'm going to show you it both as a boy and a girl so you can make your decision. Um, on this baby. This baby's got the most beautiful skin tone. Such a light, beautiful skin tone, beautiful veining on this baby. I mean, this baby's in pristine condition. No shiny spots, no nothing. I've only done like one or two videos on this baby and that's it. My babies stay covered um, on a little bouncy chair or whatever and a blanket over them, they stay covered. It is a beautiful bald baby and like I said, can come as a boy or a girl. Uh, nice mobility to this baby. The baby's head does go back when you pick up the baby. So, you know, that, that look of, uh, you know, a newborn baby, just so cute. Love the fists, how they go in and the feet, the feet curl in. It's just so cute how they bend up like that. But I'm going to show you this baby up close and all the features so you can see. There is the face. Look at the eyelashes, you guys. So pretty in the painted eyebrows. Look at that vein through the head. All the veining on this, the, um, you know, spider veins are just phenomenal. Look at the ears. So pretty. And then you see the body here weighted very well. It's got the polyfill and it's got the um angel polyfill, I believe it is. And so, yeah, this one's got the angel polyfill, the um glass beads. And then as I go down, you can see the beautiful legs. Look at this skin tone and look at this veining. It's just phenomenal. Look at those feet. How pretty. Look at the bottom, all those wrinkles. Isn't that adorable? And I love how the feet bend like that. It's just adorable. Absolutely adorable. The little fat rolls on it. So cute. Weighted very good. Very good. Wears newborn size clothes. And like I said, can come as a boy or girl. Now that I'm seeing this one like this, I keep saying I see it more as a boy. You know, that's what I do. But of course, you just tell me what you want. I had her as a girl, but um, definitely can come as a boy. And I'm going to show you both. But isn't that baby beautiful? There's the other ear. There's the back of the head. The spider veining was so phenomenal on this baby. And remember, you can always get the hair done on it. You get hair drawn or rooted, however you want. Um, but it is very cute and bald as well. Um, especially like, you know, for girls wearing bows um, or um, boys wearing hats. The mobility on this baby, look at, moves so good. The head moves so good and the arms move so good. You know, the mobility of this baby, of them moving is so good too. I love that. So now I'm going to show you both versions and what this baby will come home with if you want it as a boy or a girl. We'll start with the girl version of it. Um, I will leave the onesie on being a um, vinyl baby and it has a diaper on. Okay, we're going to do the little white socks. Here's the outfit it'll come with if it comes as a girl. So it's going to be this little corduroy outfit. It's a onesie and it's got pink and mustard yellow flowers with the brown and then the corduroy dress just snaps in the crotch. You see it crisscrosses in the back and it, the dress is kind of a um, like a orange, like a deep orange. So pretty. And then it'll come with, I'm going to do the pink bow if it's, you know, for the girl, the pink bow to match the pink in there and then just little white socks. So let me show you this baby dressed as a girl and then I'll show you it dressed as a boy. And then you could just tell me. I'm asking 200 in the U.S. for this one. That is a steal, you guys. That's 200 shipped. So um, that covers the shipping cost too within the United States. That's a really good price for this baby because this baby's in pristine condition. Pristine, no shiny spots, no nothing on this baby. At the end, I will show you pictures again of, um, you know, even though I got it up close, I'll show you pictures at the end of just the, the fingertips and all of that. I took photos of it and I'll show you all that. And yeah, I'm only asking $200 for this baby. That's a steal because that's including the shipping. So yeah, it's a great price. And uh, we'll come dress in a cute outfit, boy or girl. It's got the COA. It's, you know, it's a authentic baby and it's based off of a real baby. Um, that's why it's a real born. There's reborns and real borns. Now this baby was reborn, but it is a real born, meaning it just was based off of a real baby named Lewis. So it was based off a boy. But sometimes people just, you know, like their babies as girls, like it as boys, because you can with these, which is nice because they have the cloth body. So you can have whichever gender you want with this baby. So let me just show you. Um, like I said, this one as a girl, and then you can decide because it both ways, this baby, you know, babies, there are babies out there that are so pretty can be boy or girl. You know what I mean? They're just such a good looking baby. All babies are good looking, but you know what I mean? Like they just have that look that they could be boy or girl and babies. Anyways, some people have a hard time, um, you know, knowing what the baby is, unless it's dressed very girly or very boy. Like some people will mistake your baby for, 
um, you know, like a little uh, boy if it's a girl or a little girl if it's a boy. I know my nephew, because he's such a pretty boy, he was mistaken a little a couple times as a girl because they had his hair pretty long. But um, yeah, he's just such a cute, you know, my nephew's just adorable. He was a pretty boy. Like Elvis Presley. Elvis Presley was so pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. So you saw his daughter, Lisa, looked just like him. And look at how she was a girl, you know. But there you go. There is little um, Angelica. That's what I had her name. Angelica as a girl. Hopefully you guys can see everything okay there. So if you like it as a girl, that's how it'll come as a girl. Uh, and I will be sending a lovey with it and a pacifier. So if it comes, you know, if it's a girl, it's going to come with a girl lovey. If it's a boy, it'll come with a boy lovey. Now let me show you the boy version. So we'll take all this off and I'll show you this baby as a boy. Trying to just do this quick, but I just want everybody just to get an idea because when you tell people boy or girl, it's kind of, and they're only seeing the girl picture. So in their mind, maybe they're really wanting a boy and they just can't imagine it as a boy. And so they're just like, well, that, that looks too much like a girl because when it's in the girl, it does look like a girl. But watch the difference when I switch it over to a boy. This baby also has a wafer in the body. So if you're sensitive to smells, it has that powder wafer that they do in reborning and it's in the body. Let me know before I send it and I'll take the wafer out, okay? If you're sensitive to smells, I'll take it out just in case you can't, you know, take the uh, baby apart and take the wafer out yourself. I will. So just let me know. Now, as a boy, it's still going to be in the, the little white socks. We'll keep the same socks. And as the boy, it's going to come in this outfit. The little, it says Little Prince. So it's a little t-shirt and the brand is Disney. It is Disney's Mickey Mouse. It's got the little pocket with the blue and white going down, which matches the shorts behind it. I'll show you. But I wanted to dress them in outfits that were more cool for the spring. So it's got the blue trim and the little blue shirt and then the little shorts that say Mickey on it. Look at how cute that is. And that matches the pocket on it. So let me show you this baby dressed. And then, of course, he'll come with the blue mitts and the blue hat. And this stuff is brand new. So, and then he'll come with a blue lovey, all right? So if you want him as a boy, I mean, not a blue lovey, I mean, a, a boy lovey is what I mean, which doesn't make a difference. Lovies don't have to be boy or girl. You know what I mean? Like, actually, it'll probably be a neutral. I never thought about that. I'll do a neutral so it could be for boy or girl. Like, just like a teddy bear. I'll do something like that, maybe like a teddy bear or something that'd be neutral. Or if I don't have that on hand, then I will send one more girl or more boy. If that's all I have. But yeah, I think I'm just going to do a teddy bear with it. That will just be neutral for both. So you can have it, you know, as a boy or girl, and the lovey will be boy or girl. Either way, look at I love that little prince. He is a little prince. Yes, he is. And this is this size here. Believe it or not, this baby wears newborn, but this size right here, um, yes, it is newborn. I was going to say I thought it was zero to three. It is newborn, and you can see how well this is fitting on this baby. The newborn size fits well. You cannot go smaller. Um, I know 18 inches, but this is a really good size baby. I would say this baby is bigger than 18 inches because it just appears to be bigger to me. I have 18 inch babies and this one just appears to be longer. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at him as a boy. See, I almost wish I would have kept him as a boy myself when I got him. But on the site, when she had it on the site, the baby was dressed so cute in this like princess dress and all that, the way she had it dressed. Um, even though I didn't get that with the baby, the outfit, or I don't remember if I did or not. I might have. Um, but it just looked like a little uh, little princess. So I got it. But even though I'm a boy mom, if I would have dressed this as a boy once, saw it like this, I would have wanted it as a boy. Look at it. It's like so boy. But again, it was based off a of boy. So take that little thing off, and then I'm just going to show you with the hat, because he'll have the little hat on when he comes home. But I just want you guys to get the gesture of both boy or girl. And then, like I said, it'll come with a lovey and a pacifier to go for boy or girl. Look at him. Oh, my gosh. Isn't that adorable, you guys? Oh, my gosh. See, now I just see all boy with this one. But a few seconds ago, I seen all girl. But if you were to ask my personal opinion, I think more boy. But again, this baby's so pretty, so it could be boy or girl. But isn't that just darling? Look at him. Oh my goodness, so cute. And see, that's what I'm saying. Bald heads are okay because you can do hats, you can do bows. It's adorable. And the mobility, like I said, on this baby is so good. It's weighted so good. It's got the beautiful angel polyfill inside. So it's just, just squishy and, you know, just beautiful. It really is. Again, $200 for this baby shipped in the United States only. There is my email. I take PayPal or Cash App. Um, send me an email if you're interested in this baby. Grab them because that's a great price for a COA baby. And also my silicone girl. That's a wonderful price too because, like I said, if I had just painted that one, I said in my last video, if I had painted that, um, I would have sold her for $5.25 easily because she's just, you know, she was everything I did to her and just, you know, she just is phenomenal. And of course, she would come with a bigger box opening and all that, how I do it with my painted babies. But 300 because she's coming out of my collection. And it's a COA baby. So you can't beat that, right? You just can't. 
All right, you guys. I hope you guys are doing well. Everybody take care. God bless. And I will see each and every one of you in my very next upload. <laughs>